Corrupt officials and overcrowding are just some of the problems still facing the country's prisons. The Minister of Justice and Correctional Services, Ronald Lamula, says investigation into the recent incident of uh, drug smuggling at the Deben Westville prison has established that uh, several officials were involved. Heads have rolled at Deben Westville prison. Four officials have been suspended, while three have been removed from their post. One has since not returned to work. Lamola says corruption and drug smuggling are rife at correctional facilities countrywide. I did mention that errant officials involved in the smuggling of craft <coughs> and other offenses will not be spared any mercy. This development to indi do indicate that we have a duty to protect correctional centers from officials whose intent is to destroy the gospel of rehabilitation in this country. Corrupt officials and overcrowding are exacerbating the situation. As of 31 March 2019, the number of inmates stood at 162,875 against an accommodation capacity of 118,572 bed spaces which translate to a 37% level of overcrowding. Opposition parties blame mismanagement and what they call an ineffective criminal justice system for the challenges. South Africa has one of the highest imprisonment rates in the world, at 286 prisoners per 100,000 of population. So overcrowding remains the first and most urgent problem to be solved. Yet a solution has evaded us for at least the last 50 years. In 2014, during the budget vote, it was admitted that overcrowding was a serious problem that was being faced in South African prisons. It is now 2019, and overcrowding is still a significant issue being faced by prisons throughout the country. The increasing inmate population and overcrowding of 30% as of March 2019 is a real concern. The allocated amount to the Department of Correctional Services for 2019-20 of 25 billion rand is inadequate and will pose huge challenges to the department to carry out its mandate. The department says there are at least 47,000 awaiting trial prisoners in jails. Prisons are being built around the country to alleviate overcrowding. Manilisi Tubase, SABC News, Parliament.